oh, the infamous bird nest but it wouldn't be a Jacqueline video without that so I'm gonna start with doing my eyebrows and Anastasia dip brow pomade in medium brown Oh my god, this light on my camera is like literally killing me. Like I can't even see. I can't even. So we're gonna try our best because I need a video out. <laughs> it's been too long. So so we got through one. And I like to just kind of blend that front part out. There we go. So actually, I'm going to use this just to clean up the brows. This is Max Paint Pot in Soft Ochre. And I just use this random like tiny little lip brush that I found um, in my makeup collection. Not really sure where it came from or anything like that, but... And I just kind of blend down with my finger. Oh, okay, come through. Big brow, come through. Okay, well, we'll fix that later. Okay, so we'll clean up the top of the brows later. Pacifica Natural Minerals, and um, I'm gonna use it. It's just a Pacifica eyeliner, and it's like a gray color. So, I'm just gonna take that and put it all over the lid. And I'm just gonna take a finger, kind of blend it out a little bit. Don't go too far up into the crease or anything like that. I'm going to take this um, crown brush, it's a C441 Pro Blending Crease Brush, and I'm going to first take this caramel color in the Anastasia palette, and I'm just going to dust that um, right in the crease. little color right here it's just a light flesh toned color so okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and dust this focusing mostly on the like right under the uh, arch circular motions always work very well and this is a brush which I love this brush it's actually a Sonia Kashuk 17 but like look at that it's it's a perfect brush so now I am going to go in with this tiny elf brush dollar brush awesome deal with the LBD which is the black um, the MRZ palette I'm gonna pack it on the inner third of the lid Shit, I kind of went like halfway, right? <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, well, it's a Pure Minerals Utility Brush. Clean brush, nothing on it. And I'm just going to kind of blend, if you will, a little bit of this. Not blending it too far because it is black. Black is not forgiving. Just, it's, it's not. <laughs> Okay, so then I'm going to take a little bit of more and put it on the outer corner. Kind of map out and blur the edges just a bit. 
So I'm gonna take a bit of this Morocco color, which it's a little bit more orangey toned, but it works. It works. We're just gonna go in on that outer crease with this and just give it a nice little something something. A slight circular motions. Don't wanna piss it off. So now what I'm going to get is this freaking adorable palette from Tokidoki. I'm going to take this bullet color and just with a finger, because it's pigmented, put it in the middle of that black. Remember to just, you know, not so much black because like it's unforgiving. I keep saying that, but it really is. What I'm going to also do is take a little bit of glitter. And this is just like that Halloween Fantasy Maker confetti glitter. Um, got it from the Halloween store. Oh my god, Halloween's coming up! Yes, I can't wait. I'm excited. So, I'm gonna take this um duo brush on adhesive, it's my new favorite. It works really fast, and it's just one of the ones I like. And I'm just gonna place this like barely where the silver is and kind of tap it out a little bit and then get that glitter and tap over it. Also did the other eye and put on some lashes and some wing liner. So right now I'm gonna go ahead and do my face. Lumi, um, called Lumi Healthy Luminous Makeup True Match Lumi. So I'm just gonna use two pumps of the dark and one of the light. Yeah. I'm going to take my uh, Sigma F80 Kabuki brush and go in. And now I'm going to take this uh, Master Conceal, this is from Maybelline, in medium. And I'm just going to... Under the eye, I'm just going to kind of tap a lot of it into place. I don't like to, you know.
so there's that. You know, one of my favorites is just big and fluffy. And um, I take this dark one and the light one. I know they're like far apart, but I like to put them under my eye. I like to kind of use the bake method. So while that's, you know, cooking itself, I like to go in with this Eco Tools um, angle brush. I take my sunny bronzer, then I just, you know, Come on in with that. This real techniques brush. I'm gonna take this more peachy toned color and dust off. Most of that. I'm gonna use my MAC Soft and Gentle Holy Grail. I like to look like a frosted mermaid and artistry blush brush, but I just like to use it for this. So. Blend out as much, and then I usually just take some down my nose. And I just put some at the tip of my nose. I like to snatch it. Girl, girl, girl. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna get through this. So, cause um, no. glittery halo eye. Hashtag glittery halo eye. Got T zone. Baby hairs. I hate when people do that. Like just. Why? Stop. 